Here's why you are de-stressing all wrong. Hey everybody, it's Dr. Duggan, primary care, trained in family and adolescent medicine. We're de-stressing in different ways, but we're doing it wrong when we're trying to do it like somebody else. Just like we're all individuals, just like we all experience stress in different ways and carry our stress in different ways, we have different ways of managing it to de-stress as well. For some people, it may be sleep. I know if I don't get seven to eight hours a night, I can definitely feel it the next day. Um, for some, it may be different coping methods such as journaling. That can be helpful if you just write down those thoughts, get them out on paper so they're out of your head and you can see them and deal with them from that standpoint. For some, it may be exercise. It's that natural endorphins, your natural high that can be helpful for you and clarify your mind so that you can deal with whatever it is that is stressing you out. And then for others, it may be that, okay, we got to be a little bit more realistic about what's going on and how can we break things down into more manageable tasks for us so that we can still reach set goal, even though the journey may be a little bit differently than we plan to get there. So I hope that's been helpful on your de-stressing journey here in health, Dr. Duggan. Bye.